Dear distinguished readers, today, we embark on a sparkling adventure into the world of diamonds. Diamonds, those brilliant gems that captivate our hearts and drain our wallets. But fear not, for I shall be your trusty guide in this dazzling quest to differentiate the real McCoy from the imposters. So grab your magnifying glass and put on your detective hat, because we're about to unravel the secrets of distinguishing diamond real from diamond fake. Ah, the fog test. A classic gemology trick that doubles as a party trick. If you ever find yourself at a social gathering surrounded by people adorned in diamonds, whip out this test, and you'll become the life of the party. Just imagine the looks of amazement as you fog up your precious stones like a magician about to perform a trick. Now, let's break it down. When you breathe on a real diamond, it's like whispering sweet nothings to a lover the fog disappears in a heartbeat. That's because diamonds are excellent heat conductors, and they can quickly dissipate the warmth from your breath. It's like a magic vanishing act, and you can bask in the glory of your authentic gem. But beware, my dear friends, for the world of fake diamonds is vast and cunning. If you breathe your warm sigh on a counterfeit diamond, it might linger like an awkward conversation at a family reunion. Why, you ask, because those imposters often lack the thermal conductivity of the real deal. They can't handle the heat, so they hold on to that fog for dear life. So, the next time you find yourself at a jewelry store, or your eccentric aunt decides to show off her latest diamond acquisition, you know what to do. Grab your magnifying glass, strike a Sherlock Holmes pose, and channel your inner diamond detective. With the fog test in your repertoire, you can impress your peers, save your wallet from dubious purchases, and maybe even score a free drink or two at the bar all in the name of science and sparkling stones. Remember, folks, it's all in good fun and curiosity. We're not here to ruin anyone's sparkle parade. We're simply having a laugh while we unveil the truth behind these dazzling gems. So, fog away, my fellow enthusiasts, and let the diamonds reveal their secrets with each magical breath. Happy fogging. Ah, the newspaper test the literary examination for our sparkling companions. It's a test that will put your diamonds, refractive chops, to the ultimate challenge. Imagine yourself in a dimly lit room, your diamond clasped gently between your fingers like a prized possession. Grab a nearby newspaper, or grab a tablet if you're living in the future, and hold your gem closely over the text. Now, squint those eyes and prepare for the magic of optics. A true diamond, being the diva of refraction that it is, will bend and scatter light like a mischievous sprite. As a result, the letters on the newspaper will dance, sway, and blend together like a tango on a moonlit night you'll be left rubbing your eyes, wondering if you should check the prescription of your glasses. But here comes the twist. A fake diamond, being the shy wallflower that it is, lacks the optical prowess of its genuine counterpart. When you hold it over the newspaper, it'll behave itself. Every letter stands in line like well-behaved soldiers, crisp and clear, refusing to participate in the refractive ruckus. Now, before you conclude that you've stumbled upon a mirage rather than a real diamond, take a moment to question your eyesight. Maybe, just maybe, you need to schedule that long overdue visit to the optometrist. However, if your vision is as keen as an eagle's, and the newspaper's text remains sharp and unaffected under your diamond's gaze, you might have a fake diamond lurking in your treasure chest. But fear not, dear reader, there are other tests to undertake, and more giggles to be had in this diamond detective journey. So, carry on with your investigations, and remember, even if your gem turns out to be an imposter, its sparkle can still light up your heart though perhaps not the newspaper. Keep those eyes sharp and your wit sparkling bright. Until next time, my diamond-loving detectives. Ah, the water test. It's like giving your diamond a quick swimming lesson without getting it all soggy. So, listen up, folks, as we dive into the watery depths of diamond authentication. Imagine you have your precious diamond in hand, and you're ready to do the water test. Find a clear glass of water, no fish or seaweed required, just pure H2O. Now, take a deep breath and drop that gem into the water like a boss. If your diamond takes a graceful dive to the bottom of the glass, congratulations. You've got yourself a real diamond. You see, real diamonds are dense little suckers, packed with carbon atoms, and that density is what makes them sink faster than a lead balloon. However, if your diamond decides to pull off a magic trick and floats on the surface like a boy, well, Houston, we have a problem. It's more likely a fake diamond made from materials with lower density, such as cubic zirconia or moissanite. We don't want to call your diamond a liar, but it might have a buoyancy complex. 
Now, don't jump to conclusions just yet. Some other materials, like glass or quartz, can also sink, so we might have a diamond doppelganger on our hands. But don't fret, my dear gem enthusiasts, there are more tests in the treasure chest of diamond identification. Remember, this water test is just one piece of the puzzle in the grand quest of telling the real sparklers from the fakes. So, if your diamond passes this buoyancy exam with flying colors, give it a pat on the facet and keep exploring the other sparkling avenues of diamond authentication. Stay curious, stay adventurous, and may your diamonds always sink and never float. Happy gem hunting, ah, the scratch test, the moment of truth for our dazzling detective work. This test requires finesse and a steady hand, for we shall pit the mighty diamond against a humble piece of glass. It's the ultimate showdown between the toughest kid on the block and an innocent bystander. As we prepare for this epic clash, I must insist on a disclaimer, please don't try this at home with your grandmother's heirloom or any other precious gems. We shall only use diamonds that you are absolutely certain are not priceless family treasures. Safety first, my fellow gem sleuths. Now, with our safety goggles on and our nerves of steel, let the scratch test commence. Grab a trusty piece of glass, perhaps an old window pane or a sturdy drinking glass. Place your diamond in one hand and the glass in the other. Take a deep breath, and remember, diamonds are tough, but accidents happen, so let's not be too overconfident. Gently, oh so gently, bring the diamond in contact with the glass and give it a delicate scratch. If you hear the resounding victory cry of the diamond and see no trace of damage on its surface, rejoice. You have indeed found a genuine diamond a true champion of hardness. But wait, if there's a visible scratch on your diamond, fear not. It doesn't necessarily mean you're dealing with a complete charlatan. The diamond might have encountered some tough characters in its journey to your possession. Nevertheless, it's probably a good idea to double-check its authenticity with the other tests in our gem detective arsenal. Remember, dear readers, the scratch test is just one piece of the puzzle. When in doubt, combine it with the other tests, like the fog, the rainbow, and the dance tests, to build a comprehensive profile of your precious gem. Diamonds, like us, are unique and sometimes imperfect, but that's what makes them all the more special. So, my gem sleuths, venture forth with your newfound knowledge and wield it wisely. And always remember, even if you end up with a fake diamond, it doesn't mean your spirit can't shine as brightly as the real thing. Happy gem hunting and may your paths be filled with laughter and genuine sparkle. And there you have it, my dear readers, a light-hearted and quirky guide to telling the real diamonds from the fakes. Remember, the world of diamonds can be a dazzling and tricky place, but armed with this knowledge, you'll be a sparkling gem detective in no time. Have fun out there, and may your diamonds always be real, your laughter endless, and your hearts forever shiny.